Hey my jelly beans, welcome back to my channel and happy Pride Month. So I was thinking about what video I wanted to film for my first video in Pride Month. I want to read some homophobic comments and I know what you're thinking. Why would you make your first video a video of you reading homophobic comments? Isn't that a little weird? And for me, I kind of see it as using my platform to show the words people say, but how you can also take those words and not let them affect you, not let them make you feel bad. And and use them as empowerment and they have to see that no matter what anyone says you can persevere and push through it and be a better person so that's really what I want to show in this video and let them know that their words don't affect me and just have a good time with you guys <laughs> So today I want to sit down and read some homophobic comments. I get it. This isn't the most Pride Month video that I could do, but I have a lot of other videos planned for this month, so this is just one of those that I gotta do because I thought it would be fun. But if you're not subscribed to my channel, be sure to hit the- and I oh, no. What the heck was that? But if you're not subscribed to my channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button and join the Jelly Bean Squad. I do make a lot of views about my sexuality and my life, so if that's something you're into, be sure to subscribe. But it's Pride Month, you guys. I'm so happy. This month is gonna be really good, and you know, my goal for this month is to hit 5,000 subscribers. I know that's a pretty big goal, and I'm not 100% sure if we're gonna hit it, but if we manifest it, we're gonna make it happen. We're just gonna have a good time with this channel and hopefully make as many new friends as possible, help each other out, and really grow this community. But you know, just to start out, we're gonna read some of these comments, and... Uh, Daddy, chill. That's gonna be our video today. So the first comment is, the man in this video has serious, legitimate mental health issues. I just think that that's so funny that someone can come on my channel, spend five minutes or less watching a video, and then diagnose me with mental health issues and say that I need help. Who are you? What are you doing on my channel? Personally, I don't get offended with that because I do have mental health issues. Why would you say that? No, I'm not even gonna say that. Personally, I really don't get offended with this because it doesn't matter, but I just think it's funny how someone will hop on someone's channel and then say something like this. Who are you? What are you talking about? One of my favorites? Okay. F I don't know why, but people saying that really just cracks me up because, like, I take offense to it. Fat. And I- oh. Was that all? Did you have to say it? Because I actually appreciate the effort that you put into it. You definitely made it seem a little bit more spicy than the other person. You feel better? Okay, you can leave now. You sound gay, and I kill gays. And then they put like some sound effects of like a chainsaw. They were a slasher, like it was Freddy and Jason. I personally believe that if I was in a horror movie, I would be the last survivor. There's only two genders. And when people say stuff like this, it really just makes me question why you get so bent out of shape. It's like you're worried about what everyone else is doing when you should be worried about your own life. You've only liked cis people, so you've only liked guys who like girls. I don't think you know what cisgender means, because that's not what it means. Bi and pan are the same thing. Pan is just a way for people to feel special, like demisexual and all that other bull. Straight, gay, bi, and ace are all there is. You either like women, men, neither, or both. That's all. Again, I'll say this, why does it matter? You say you're straight, you say you're bi, you say you're gay, you say you're pan, whatever. I personally don't care what anyone identifies as, so why should you? Why do you care so much? You guys are always the first to say, I don't care what anyone does, as long as you don't affect me. But then, you wanna say, you're affecting me by saying that. That doesn't make sense. Either play by your rules, or don't, but find a way to make it make sense. But I just wanted to read some of these to start out our Pride Month. You just gotta be yourself, and if you're being yourself, nothing can bring you down. But I wanna thank you guys for coming back every single week and joining us. We are gonna make this an amazing Pride Month. I have a lot of videos planned for you guys, so I really do appreciate you guys coming out here and supporting me. But see you guys next time, and have an amazing Pride Month. And as always, stay free, my jelly beans.